You're watching Charger Nation. I'm Henry Chisholm. And UNH returns home for a homecoming where they took on Stonehill. Both teams fighting for a position in the Northeast 10 for that Northeast 10 championship game. Right now, UNH was number one going into the game. But Stonehill starts off fast with a touchdown in the first quarter from Logan Meyer to no overtime. And UNH answers back on this bomb from Ronnie Nelson. The pass is tipped, and Henry Adagunle catches it for a 40 yard touchdown that tied the game at seven in the first quarter. Adagunle getting some love from the big screen. And then UNH would go up after this touchdown run from Mike DeCaro, but the point after was missed by Anthony Greenfield. And Stonehill would take advantage. A touchdown run right here from Colin Marcus. He runs this one in from four yards out. They made their PAT, and that made it 14 to 13 in favor of the Skyhawks. More special teams issues for UNH as this field goal attempt is blocked by the Stonehill special teams. That would have made it 16 14, but again, the kick was blocked. The Stonehill fans liking that and more special teams issues coming up later on in the highlight show for the Chargers. But they would atone for that mistake thanks to a Nelson touchdown pass to Mike Flacco that made it 20-14 late in the first half. That was an 11-yard touchdown pass. The PAT was good. And it stayed 20-14 because of this interception from Najee Brown, the freshman who was leading the Chargers in interceptions. That was his third of the season. So second half action, after a touchdown from Nick Music, Stonehill started their comeback. A touchdown from Logan Meyer to Gordon McLeod from six yards, six yards out made a 26-21 to in favor of the Chargers. The field goals didn't work, so they tried to fake this one. It does not work another special team's gaffe. Good job by Stonehill to recognize that. And then rough defense in the coverage for the Chargers on this play. A 50-yard pitch and catch from Meyer to Robitaille. As the Skyhawks march down the field, down five, and Meyer finds Curry White in the back of the end zone. They went for two. It was good. They go up 29-26. UNH is stunned late in the fourth quarter. One last shot, back of the end zone to Nick Music, incomplete. And Stonehill walks away with a shocking 29-26 victory on the blue and gold turf at Ralph Della Camera Stadium. I talked to the players and the coach about that final play and why they didn't kick the field goal to tie the game. Two, two block extra points and a block field goal. There was nothing to think about. Nick, Nick's a great player. You know, I mean, he did, it was a stutter around the outside. And, uh, you know, ultimately, you know, it was the, kind of the throw and catch kind of thing. But, you know, I, I felt I, I floated a little bit you know, more than, than, than I needed. But, you know, I thought Nick had a good chance to make a great catch. It was a great defensive play, so... So things are getting very interesting as we wind down the regular season. UNH basically has to win out if they want to play in the Northeast 10 Championship game. That's the week ahead. Thanks for watching. Charger Nation.